Hey guys, how are you doing? So Apple released iOS 17.2.1 with bug fixes to all the comparable iPhone models. iPad OS is not yet released, we will see about that a little bit later. And with this iOS 17.2.1 update, in English version there is no mention about what bugs have been fixed. Apple is always discreet about contents of the updates they provide and the same happened to the iOS 17.2.1. But with the Japanese version, one Twitter user highlighted that when we translate the release note you can see that this update includes important bug fixes and addresses problems that may drain quickly under certain conditions I think the translation little bit was off while I was trying to do it from the picture I have downloaded so here the battery drain quickly under certain conditions is the actual term that is present there so this confirms that the iOS 17.2.1 generally addresses within a week after the 17.2 release Apple worked on issues related to the battery concern. So some users did report about the battery related fast drain problem after updating to iOS 17.2 without any mentioning about that in the release note whether it is an error. Looks like Apple have made some changes and bug fixes with this 17.2.1 update. So if you are already running any of the iOS 17 uh, version then my suggestion is to update immediately to the latest 17.2.1 and if you're already using the 17.2 version then it will be good to go. When it comes to the security notes, this 17.2.1 don't have any security fixes. But if you haven't updated to the 17.2 version, then you can check that they have addressed and fixed few important high critical security risks reported by the security researchers. If you are conscious about your device and data security, then it is always good to update to the latest version. It will be really good if Apple clearly mentions what content, you know, that the bug fixes and security fixes related contents that arrives with each software update at least in near future and when we talk about the ipad os missing from this update schedule maybe in a week or two we will see the iOS 17.2.1 and so far ipad users are experiencing the moderate level of battery performance there is no fast drain reported so far as far as i know and when it comes to the mac os sonoma 14.2.1 also released with windows server bug fix when a user shares their screen maybe in the case of like multiple screens connected to their mac computer more than one uh, extended monitor setup the windows server service which is responsible for the screen sharing the incorrect screen to the other end user it seems so that sort of bug have been addressed uh, reported by a researcher in this mac os sonoma 14.2.1 so this is a minor update for mac computers so you can proceed updating it to the latest version to receive that bug fix so do update iOS 17.2.1 after using it for at least three to four days let me know in the comment section how the battery performance overall in your iphone for more useful iphone ipad and mac related tips and tricks don't forget to subscribe thank you so much for watching have a wonderful day